Hiya and welcome back to my channel eh? So today I'm going to be doing a bit of a collective haul. There's some bits I've picked up over the past week or two. There are things from Primark, Jack Wills, Superdrug, HMV and maybe some other shops that I've missed out as well. So let's just get straight into it. Okay so let's start off with Jack Wills. I normally go in Jack Wills for a browse and then walk straight back out because I don't want to pay that much money. But this day, there was a massive sign in the window it said up to 70% off and I was like, I was with Steph at the time, I was like, Steph, we've got to go in there. So we strolled in and I came across some of their cute t-shirts, normally priced at around, oh wait, I've got a tag here, let me just double check for you. Normally priced, this one's 26 95 reduced to £8 9p, I'll show you on the tag, just in case you think I'm lying, I don't know why I'd lie, but there's a tag if that even focused. So I picked up three of these t-shirts. The first one, they're all just basic, they're slightly oversized, a little bit too big for me, just because I like them like that, I don't like them too clingy. So I've got this pink one, and then on the pocket, it's just got the little Jack Wills embroidered logo. I just thought this is so cute to go with a plain t-shirt, or to go under dungarees, so, it's just a staple wardrobe item. And then I picked up one in the green as well. I haven't worn this one yet. And I just, I can't wait to wear it actually. It's so cute, it's green. I love the little different color around the neck. And then this one has just got Jack Wheels printed on there in the little logo, all right? And we picked up one more. Oh, I didn't realize this is the exact same as the green in a different color. Look at that, that's how much attention I pay. So here is the white one. Exactly the same. And then we have the same little logo, Jack Wills, on there. And I thought that was a bargain. So all in total, these three tops came to £24. And to think, like I showed you in the price tag, it's only 26 for one. So I just couldn't resist because I was like, they're such high quality. And if I wanted a plain t-shirt, I'd normally go to Primark. But these, the quality is better so they're going to last for longer. And at that price, I had to have it. Okay. So the next item from Jack Wills was priced on the tag at £56 and I thought it had been reduced to 32 so I was like, absolute bargain. But when I got my receipt after I paid, it was £16. Oh my god. I got this beautiful cropped hoodie, £16. Can we just sing that in? £16. You cannot get that from New Look H&M. This is amazing. Let me show you it now. <laughs> now I've spoken about it for so long. Here it is. It's a little nude cropped hoodie with Jack Wills in red. I wish you could like feel it. This is really weird. But on the inside it's honestly so soft. It's just so comfy. I just love wearing it for a lazy day or if I'm a bit chilly in the evenings. It's just something to pop on. And I think what I love about it, also I've said this about a million times, is the price because I wouldn't normally pay so much for this as it's not something... I don't know if I'd really live in it that much, but you just feel so cosy and warm when you have it on. I just loved it. Okay, moving on to Primark. I have found a few bargains in there at the moment. Let's start off with this mustard shirt. So I got this reduced, it was £12 reduced down to £5. And I just love the button in detail down the middle. It's just so light and flary, it's got some really like nice, what was I showing? It's just got nice sleeves, okay? And I was just thinking that for the summer, it's a lighter kind of material, so I'm gonna try and buy more things for like spring rather than winter. So I just thought, cute piece to add to my wardrobe, okay? Next bit, it's ended up on the floor. Excellent. Come back here, you. Okay. <laughs> so, I'm really liking this one. It's a print if, was it leopard print, giraffe print, whatever you kind of want to say print. This, it was £12, okay, and the same, it's got the button in detail, and it's so cute. I've worn it with my pinafore, I've worn it with jeans, and it just looks really cute. I love it, it's got little pockets as well, not that it really fits anything in, but it's a nice bit of detail. Okay, this is maybe my favourite item of everything I'm going to show you. And it's not something I would usually wear. I have posted an image, an image? Uh, blah, 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 on my Instagram of it. It is this midi skirt. 
skirt. It's pleated, if you can see, and black and white. And it just goes so well with like a plain top. <gasps> Maybe I could pair it with this white Jack Wills top. Whoa, it's like I planned it. Madness. Anyway, I don't normally wear things like this. I want to step out of my comfort zone a little bit. I've seen other bloggers wearing it and it just looks so nice. I was like, hey, B, you've got to give this a go. So I'm going to be rocking this out more, especially in the summer. Love it. I really do. Okay, that is the end for clothes. We're now going to move on to makeup. So I've seen this palette. Who did I see talk about it? It was Fab Han, I think, mentioned it in one of her videos. And I've never seen it in any stores till I went shopping yesterday. It is the Revolution Glitter Palette. It looks stunning. I mean, look at this. Look at all those shades. They're literally packed with glitter for £10. I think I'm going to have to film a look with this. I've put a little bit on today. I'm going to have to film a look with it because it looks just stunning. And to go with that, because it's loose glitter and not like shadowy, I'm pretending to know what I talk about, as you can tell, I bought myself some glitter glue to stick it on. It just comes in a little golden tube that looks quite cute. It's quite thick consistency, but it makes the glitter shadow stick on, essentially. Okay, so the final two items I bought were from HMV. I wanted a couple of new CDs for my car. And if you don't know, one of my favourite artists is Halsey Halsey, however she wants to pronounce her name. Um, so I picked up the Hopeless Fountain Kingdoms album. That was a mouthful. Hopeless Fountain Kingdom. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, that one. That one by Halsey, okay? I picked it up so I can listen to it in my car and sing along to it. And I also picked up this album by The Wonder Years, as I absolutely loved them. They had all three albums in the store, but I was like, hey, let's just pick one. And oh, I love The Wonder Years. I can't wait to be jamming to this bad boy in my car. Literally cannot. So that's everything from my haul. It wasn't like loads of things, but why is there another CD in here? Oh, that's something I took out of my car. Okay, never mind. Yeah, and then there's not loads of things, but I just really wanted to show you what I did have. So I hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you did, so I know you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel, and I will see you around here again. See you guys. Bye.